have unanswered questions about the Christian life. Or maybe you find it confusing how to follow Jesus daily. Today, we're taking a look at the ESV Reformation Study Bible Student Edition, and I think it's going to bring some clarity to those questions that you have. Plus, if you stick around all the way to the end, I have a special offer for you that's going to help get this Bible in your hands today. So let's take a look at this Bible. The Reformation Study Bible Student Edition is built on the teachings of R.C. Sproul. The verse-by-verse -verse notes are built from over 75 pastors and Bible teachers. All of this will help you gain clarity on key subjects of the Christian faith and ultimately be able to apply that knowledge of God to your daily life. If the goal is to understand truth and grow in your faith, then this is the perfect Bible for you. Also, there's a gift that you get along with this Bible. If you register your study Bible with Ligonier, you get access to over 40 eBooks and a free six-month subscription to Table Talk, a monthly devotional with daily Bible study. So let's talk about this Bible. I really like this Bible. I think this Bible has a sweet aesthetic. It's pretty simple. There's not too much going on in the front cover. And it's not too big. It can fit in your bag. You can take it with you. And you can't say that about every study Bible. And when we open it up and take a look inside, that's where it gets really cool. I like the feel, as I said. It comes with these two Bible markers that you can use to mark different places. It has a premium feel. The pages are thin, but that's okay. It depends upon what you use to mark up your Bible. You're going to have to, to see if that works for you. This may not be the greatest Bible to take notes in, but it's going to give you a lot of content to think about and to pray about. And when we look at the table of contents, you can see how each book of the Bible has questions that are going to be answered there in the text. Some major questions like, how are humans made in the image of God? What is a covenant? Etc. and etc. And you can see all of these different questions here in the table of contents, which is great because it allows you to search maybe for that question and go to that space, that place in Scripture. And then you can see when you get there, these question boxes then correlate back to the text that's right there, helping answer that question and connect that question actually to a text of Scripture. This is kind of similar to the Systematic Theology Study Bible that I did a review of recently, and it, and it helps you kind of connect specific texts to specific questions so that you can memorize those Scriptures and have that answer at the ready when you might be ask that question, or you might be trying to remember or wonder what scripture says about specific topics. This is really helpful when we're doing our personal study. Let's take a closer look at the gospel of John and kind of use this one book as a control to look at how books are handled, how they're introduced, and, and what might be best for you in looking at a study Bible. See, when we open to John here, the thing I love right off the bat, as you can see, John 14, 6, one of the key verses in the Gospel of John, right here on this left side, it highlights right from the beginning what this Gospel is going to lay out and what it's going to be about, and a key verse to even memorize. Again, coming back to Scripture, memorization. And it's that we should believe in the Lord Jesus Christ as our Lord and Savior. That's the whole reason that John wrote his gospel. Like most study Bibles, it gives an introduction to the book and it gives an understanding of who John is, the history behind it, a little bit of uh, the difference between the gospel of John and the other gospels, the synoptic gospels. Here's some major history and background as well, along with major lessons and themes of the book. Now, this is very similar to most study Bibles. It's just laid out differently. I love the aesthetic. I love how it looks and how it all plays together. It feels like a cohesive, thought-out way to present the beginning of John. And as we open up the first pages of John, we can see these text boxes again with an answer to a question. And if you went back to the table of contents, you'd see that question labeled, 
under the questions in the questions that show in the book of John. These boxes are on top of even extra to the verse by verse exposition and teachings that you're going to see down in the bottom. And, and you can see these footnotes in these texts are, are very meaty. There's a lot here. This isn't just a one word, one thought, but it's going to help guide you through a verse by verse reading of the text. This is a fantastic study Bible for someone who's looking to learn more about their faith, to dive deeper into scripture and have everything in one place as you study. You're not going to have to have multiple commentaries open and other things because honestly, people aren't just going to do that, especially if they're starting out studying scripture for themselves. They're not going to have to just keep going to Google every time, which I wouldn't recommend. They're trying to figure something out about the scriptures. Those questions are going to be answered right here in the text with thought out, simple answers, with cross references, other ways to, to get at the information you're looking for. Now, there are some differences between the student edition and the regular edition. I'm not going to go in depth there. I'll link a video down below by Matthew Everhart. He did a fantastic review of the Reformation Study Bible. And really, the main difference is a lot of the extra materials that come at the end of the, the regular study Bible versus the student edition, those are some of the differences that will outline and, and mark some uh, of the the changes that you might want that as opposed to this is a bigger Bible. But go check that review out after this video if you want to learn more about that specific Bible. Now, here it is, the deal. What was I talking about? I said if you stuck around to the end, I had an offer. And that's from Ligonier Ministries. The link down in the description below, you can check out and you can leave a donation of any amount and they're going to send you a ESV Reformation Study Bible Student Edition, no matter whatever donation you make. So if you're looking for a last minute gift right now uh, for a student, or you just want this study Bible for yourself, because I think it can go for anyone, you can check that out below. That deal will only last until midnight on December 31st, 2021. So if you're watching this video after the fact and it's now 2022, I'm sorry that deal is gone. But if you're going to click right now, I'd go to the description, click on that link. I don't get anything from this. This isn't an affiliate link. I don't get uh, anything other than knowing that I'm helping you find ways to study God's word and apply it rightly to your life. So I just wanted to get this video out to you as quick as possible so that you could see that deal and you could get a study Bible for yourself. If you haven't already, sign up for the 30-day challenge. And if you're looking for other study Bibles, here's the video you should watch next.